Great. All right, so we're going to get ourselves warmed up by others who will join us. Let's get in touch. Good. Heel will come in front, bending that support leg. Here we go. Okay, heel comes to the front. Not an emergency, but he's upset. High knees, hinge forward. Butt kickers, elbows, elbows to the back. Open up your chest. Slide your hips across the plane. Arm comes up and over. Toe is lifted. Okay, let's pivot. Both toes face one direction. Lean forward, bend that forward knee. Lean into it. You're in a lunge. Good, straighten that leg. Bring your arms overhead. We'll lean back slightly. Good. Right leg is extended. We're going to slide that right arm down the right leg. If your left leg is extended, left arm slides down. Other arm comes up. Pull the shoulder back. And we'll put your hands. Good. Come up to a standing position. We're going to rock back so that front toe comes up off the floor. Good, bring the front toe flat on the floor, pivot your toes so both are facing in front, turn them in slightly, stretch your arms out wide to the side, fingers lace behind your back, pull your shoulders back, lean forward. Roll back up to standing, release your hands, one hand comes to either elbow, roll down, and let's come back. Forward here with the pendulum. Stay hinged forward. Release your hands down to the floor. And hold here for gravity pull you down. For three, two, one. Roll up to a standing position. Pivot your toes in the opposite direction. Bend that front knee. Arms come onto the leg. Okay. Leaning into a stretch. Straighten your leg. If your left leg is extended, your left arm slides down that leg. Right arm comes up. Pull the shoulder back. Look up at your hands. Roll up to a standing position. Rock your weight back on your rear leg, front toe lifts. Good. Feet are flat on the floor. Scoot your feet in slightly wider than hip width. Hinge forward, hands come just above the knees. Round the back, looking down, and arch looking up. Round and arch. Round and arch. Roll up to standing. Let's stretch our wrists. Backs of your wrists together. And reverse your hands. Give your wrists a turn. And reverse that. Good. We'll 
we're ready to go. We're going to start with jacks. So you can either do a straight jumping jack where you're jumping, or you can step out for your jacks, alternating sides. So you're either jumping or not. That's one. I'm going to show you the exercises before we do it. Then we're going to do a side lunge. We're going to start with one side and then we're going to do the other, not alternating two. I have a weight in either hand. I'm going to step out for my lunge. Weight's going to come down to that toe. Then I'm going to either step together, bringing the weight to my side, or variation would be step out, bring the knee up, weight can go overhead. Okay, so we're going to do that same thing on both sides. First, we do all the right or all the left, and then the opposite one. So we start with jacks. Here we go. We've got 20 jacks to start. Let's go. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Grab your weights. Side lunge. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Keep your chest up. Eight. Seven. I stay up. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Other side. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back to the top, put your weights down. 20 jacks, round two out of three. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pick up those weights. Round two side lunges. Start with one side. Ten. You can always make the weights out if it's too much. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Last round, back to our jacks. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Side lunges. Ten. Nine, eight, I'm feeling warm, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, other side, ten, Nine, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Well done, grab some water. Next set, we're doing two exercises, two rounds. We're gonna start with mountain climbers. So you can do these with a chair. You can do them with the counter. You can do them on the floor. I'm gonna demo the chair. So I have my chair in front of me. I come into a plank position. And I'm going to run in that position for my mountain climber. If you want to do them on the floor with a mat, same thing, you're running. You can do them with a wall running or the counter. The lower you are, the harder it is. Okay, so that's one, the mountain climber. The second is fast feet. So fast feet, we're going out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in. Okay, so we're moving our feet very fast for both. Once we're moving them as if we're running, and the other time we're moving them in and out. Here we go, two rounds. We're gonna start with mountain climbers. I'm gonna grab my stopwatch. So you've got 20 seconds for these mountain climbers. Get yourself ready in your plank position, on your mark, get set, go. Bring those knees nice and high. Neck is neutral. Hop off from the feet. Press forward. Soft landing. You're 15 seconds in. And soft, fast feet. 20 seconds. Out, out, in, in. Let's go. Get that pattern going. You can start slowly. So you get the pattern and then pick up your pace. Try not to look down at your feet. Time, back to mountain climbers. Second final round here, let's go. 20 seconds. I stay up, neck is neutral. Halfway there. Pull those knees in high. Time. Fast feet. Let's do it, 20 seconds. Good. Time. Excellent. Grab your mat. You need a weight on the floor with your mat. One weight. Okay, we're gonna get ourselves into a boat position. So legs are raised, upper back is off the floor, and we're gonna do twists, like so. If you wanna modify that, keep your feet on the floor while you do these twists, okay? That is going to make it much easier. All right, so legs raised, Harder, feet down, easier. You've got 20 twists coming up. One weight between two hands, bringing that weight all the way across your body. Elbow comes to the floor on each side, or at least close to the floor. Here we go. Legs raised if you want to. 
and it's 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, going back up, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, put that weight down, lie back, pull your knees into your toes. Extend your legs, feet stay on the floor, we're going to do some bicycles here. Hands are behind the head, raise this off the floor. We're going to bring our elbow to our knee and we're going to bicycle our legs. We've got 20. Go all the way across, other elbow stay along the floor. Extend that leg as far as you can. Good. Two, three, four, five, six, really twist, seven. Eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Roll up and roll onto your side. Hand comes under your head on your side. Bend the lower leg. Upper leg is straight. Bring that leg in front of the mat. Toe is pointing down. Pull your shoulder back. We're going to do our rainbow arcs. So the leg is going to come across into the rainbow and then back. Here we go. Across and back for one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. Roll back onto your back. Remember which leg you just did. It's the next round we're going to do the other one. So make a note right now which leg you worked. Next time you have to work the other leg. Here we go. Grab that weight. Pull back to our twists. So set yourself up. Legs are either bent knees, feet on the floor. Or extended, upper back is off the floor and we'll twist it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Weight comes down, bicycle crunches, hands behind the head. Set yourself up. Here we go. Lift those legs. And it's one, two, three, four, five. Really twist the back of your body. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Bring those knees into the chest. Working the opposite leg. Roll onto your side. Hand comes under your head. Bend the lower leg. Straighten the top leg. Toe points down. Shoulder comes back. Here we go for our arcs. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Let's roll over. Double up the mat. We're going to get into tabletop position. So double it under your knees. We're going to take a beast position here. So my hands are below my shoulders. I'm going to curl my toes under so that I press up onto my toes. I'm going to press my knees up off the mat. And I'm just going to hold here for a thousand minutes. So the knees are covering off the mat. Open up your fingers wide. Press into the mat. Neck is neutral for 10, 9, 8, 7. Six, five, four, three, two, one. 
knees come back on the floor. Bring the back to your hands together. Spread your wrists. We're going to take that position again. This time, we're going to keep our lower body still, and we're going to lift one hand at a time to tap our shoulders. So let's get set up. Wrists in below your shoulders. Spread your fingers out wide. Now spread your knees out a little further. So widen your wrists. It's going to help keep your lower body at more control and still. Okay, so we're going to press back up. Now, try to keep your lower body still. Raise one hand, tap your shoulder, and the other for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Stretch the rest. I want to take a plank so you can stop walking somewhere there it is. Okay. We're going to do a plank hold, but we're going to move our feet while we're in the plank. Okay. So let's get in that low plank position. So again, I'm starting out with my knees on the floor. I'm going to put my forearms down on the floor so they're like a number 11 in front of me. Palms are down. I'm going to extend my legs behind me. So I'm in plank position. Make my tummy solid, hard. Bum is low. And then I'm going to be lifting each foot slightly off the floor as I hold this plank. Okay? I'm going to do a 30 second hold like that. So take a break before I start the timer. And ready, set, go. So you're in plank. Lift your feet. An inch or two off the floor, one at a time, obviously. Next is neutral. Good. You're 15 seconds in. You can spread your base out wider. It will make it easier. Spread your base out wider. 10 seconds to go. Three, two, one. Relax. Knees come down. Slip back in cattle pose. Take a break here. We'll come back. We're going to do the same thing again. Another 30 second plank. Get yourself ready. Forearms on the floor in that number 11. Here we go. Plank and walk. Timer is starting. Fifteen seconds in, keep the neck neutral. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Knees come down, child's pose. Good. Let's sit down for a second and we'll roll all the way onto our back. We're going to do a figure four stretch. Lie down, spin your legs, cross one leg over the other. So you're passing the ankle and knee. Bend the lower leg, put your hands above that knee, pull that leg toward you. Your back pulling the top leg toward you as well. And reverse the stretch. So opposite leg comes on top, hands come behind, the opposite side, pull it in. Then straighten your legs, straighten your arms, make your body as long as you can. And relax. Let's roll up to a seated. Chin. Cross your legs. Press your hands into the floor. Lift one arm and reach over so your ribs are lifting on one side, other side is pushing you to the back. And reverse that. One side is lifting, other side is pushing down. 
good. Extend your legs in front of you, lift your arms overhead, collapse forward, reaching for your toes and hold. Three, two, one. Roll up to a seated position. Tuck one leg in. Bring the other out to the side. Arms come overhead. Hold over your bent leg. And walk your hands around to the straightened leg. Go reach for that toe and hold. Three, two, one. Come on up. We're going to reverse this. Bring the opposite leg in. Arms come up overhead. Fold over the back leg. Walk your hands around. And reach for that straightened leg and hold. Three, two, one. Roll up to the same position. Let's bring our feet together. Press your knees now. Do I have a nice and ball? Drop those arms. Okay. And come into a comfortable seat. Let's take a deep breath in together. Thank you. Thank you. 